Kabukicho. Several years after Hong Kong was returned to mainland China in 1997, everything south of the Koma Theater to Yasukuni Street was controlled by the Teitokai. There was a bloody war going on between the Yamariyu and the Ishiyama gangs. Municipal office were the Blue Dragons, the Taiwan Mafia. Center, near the ward offices, was a third area that belonged to neither gang. The Dragon Heads and the Hong Kong Mafia were there, and so was Ginya Yabuki's gang, the Tokyo Mafia. Yamada, cutting off your little finger ain't gonna change that situation at all. You got the stuff, but I didn't get the money. How am I supposed to make a living? Don't forget I'm still a leader in the Yamaru. I can handle my duties as a Yakuza. Please, I need more time. I'll find those pricks who took off of that stuff for sure. Hey, Yamada. Could you get a physical at the city hospital tomorrow? Huh? If nothing's wrong with you, would you go to Hong Kong? What for? Hmm. If you could, take something there for me. Then I'll call this thing even. What do you say? You mean, you'd still get drugs for me? Hmm. Sure I will, Yamada. Just don't let the rest of the gang know. <laughs> right. This is a flash memory chip. Looks like a semiconductor. 
Stores data even without power? That's right. Our sources say that it can store video as well. How'd you get your hands on this baby? <laughs> Let's just say that we've got some specialists. <laughs> This town doesn't belong to you. You better remember that. Come on! Yeah. That was Yakuza fucking pain in the ass. It's them again? But we gotta make a living, so business first, huh? So I assume we've got a deal then. Of course. The whale meat business is yours. You're the only one who's getting a piece of the pie here. Don't forget you're a member of the Yamaril. Don't you look at me like that. Toilets, and you can stock with mine. Don't you know it? It's enough. Same goes for you, Ginya. Well, Yabuki, you want to shoot me? Right here or here? Or how about here? You're number two in this gang, so I won't kill you. I shot the number two. I'm officially quitting the Yamariyu as of today. You won't lose the respect of the others. In return, you leave me alone. Oh yeah. Don't think that I forgot about my responsibility. You got anything to say to me now? Huh? Hey, Ginya! I'm going with him. <coughs> Hey, boss. Call for you from Sugiyama. 
Hey there. Hey, boss, I got the goods an hour ago. This is very high quality. That's great. I can't wait. <laughs> Mr. Yabuki, there's a guest waiting for you. So he's here. been a long time. Almost three years. You're not in the Taito Kai. And yet here you are in Kabukicho. Thought you were a smart guy. You come back here after being banished. It's a goddamn pain in the ass. Even the Taito Kai and the Blue Dragons can't touch this area. That may be. But that doesn't mean you had to come back here, does it? Yeah. But there's plenty of clients around here. It's pretty convenient. Tokyo Mafia, huh? How many guys? Well, I guess I can tell you. There's six that I know for sure. Only six guys? Are you serious? You can't pull this off with only six people? Seven, including me. Hey, show. I know it's not a lot, but don't for a second let our size fool you, buddy. What matters is how many of them are pros. I see. By the way, about that favor I asked, how's Yamada? Yamada, huh? He took a wild ride on the Dragon's Head Highway. He's in a lot of pieces. The Dragon Heads? Hong Kong Mafia. What happened? I'm not even sure Yamada ever knew what happened. But believe me, he paid for it with his own body. You know? What I mean is he donated his organs to the smuggling ring to pay for the drugs. Those bastards. Wong must have done this. Where is he now? Hey, take it easy there, man. Just forget it. Or I'll get chopped up, too. You will, huh? So that's the new rule in Kabuki Cho these days. Holding grudges against a Yakuza who gets ahead, yeah. Well, you gonna work with me or what? That Wong, he gets loads of money from fat cats in Hong Kong and Japan. Almost half of their financial resources. Yeah? Can I meet Wong? Hey. Don't try anything stupid, okay? It was Yamada's fault. The Yakuza don't get how tough the Chinese Mafia really are. Good evening. She's the hostess here. I'm Eileen. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, likewise. She was an exchange student from Shanghai. Hmm. An exchange student. I get you. What? You want Yabuki to come back? Are you an idiot? Instead of that, what you should want is to break both that bastard's arms for shooting me in my fucking leg! So you won't allow it. Hold on, Simon. If it's good for us, I'd like to hear more about it. From what I hear about Yabuki, that fucking prick is rolling in dough. Huh? huh. It won't be easy. But I'll ask him to pay half of what he makes for Yamaryu. 
That's almost three million yen. All right. But four million. I want one million in my personal account. Some hush money. Understood. And in return, you close your eyes to the small stuff. I can't close both my eyes, Simon. But I will try to close one of them for you. That filthy bastard. With his deal, there won't be anything left over for you. I can live with it. Sorry. By the way, have you found an interpreter yet? Yeah, you can use Eileen for that. <sighs> Thank you. You could use me for that too. Ryoko. Mm -hmm. Ryoko, I heard that you were sick. Are you all right? Please, sit down. Thank you, Eileen. Good idea, right, Sho? Yeah. I'm sure you know that Ryoko can speak both English and Chinese very well. I can't let you. Why not, Ginya? I want to help Sho. Forget about it. Yabuki, is that you? Yabuki. Should you be here after leaving the Yakuza? Our second in command said it was all right. Sounds like the Yamaryu gang is slacking off. You even brought your woman from Taiwan. She's not from Taiwan. She's from Shanghai. And she's not Simon's girlfriend. She's Ginya's girlfriend. So where do you think I'm from? Huh? <laughs> You're pretty cute. I heard you worked everywhere in the area. But you're even using beautiful women like these. Hey, why don't you give these two sweet things to me, eh? Ginya. I'm afraid we'd never work for filthy pigs like you. Why don't you take a good look in the mirror? You. Just keep your mouth shut. Simon. You still remember that you're in charge of the Taito Kai. Don't let some fucking pricks from these bitches country try to take over our territory. Hey, Ryoko. That was great. <sighs> Show. Look after Ryoko. Hey, you make it sound like you're gonna die or something. I'm leaving the Hong Kong business to you. Well, are you sure Ryoko should be out of the hospital? She says she's recovered, and I trust her. The sweet tail meat. It's the best part. Yes, I'm sure. Say, do you have any idea how much this stuff costs? Well, it's illegal, and with the ban on whaling, I'd have to guess around 6,000 ah, or so. Not even close. The good stuff 
goes for around 60,000 an ounce. Impressive. I've heard that you could get it from time to time, and one slice of the raw flesh goes for over 10,000. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Some smart guys from around here bought up all of Japan's out-of-service whaling ships. They poach the whales. Then they sell the meat through the open market in Taiwan. That's a very good idea. And the person who thought of that? I'd say he has a very good head on his shoulders. Do you know who it is? No. It's someone you know. Yabuki? <laughs> that business. Would you like to have it? Yes. Hey! Oh, Simon. We didn't see you. Simon. Get in. I want you to talk to Yabuki. You said you were going to do business with him, right? Something about getting people citizenship in Japan. Yeah. That's not the only business. Yeah, it's okay. Give him our regards. I understand that you've decided to help us. Well... That's fine. All right. Let me say just one thing to you. The Dragonheads are working with Yabuki right now because they understand the rules of business. You must follow these rules as well. You got it. And if I don't obey them, I'll end up just like Yamato, right? Stop it. The Hong Kong Dragon Heads and the Taiwan Blue Dragons, they're both Chinese Mafia, but they're at war with each other. They're both after this area. I use both of them for our benefit. <laughs> well, that's not everything. <laughs> I didn't know you were so resourceful. <laughs> I never thought the punk would turn out like this, either. Officer Hanada from Central. You know him? Sure. Hey, this is for you. Just a little something to welcome you back home. <laughs> Very nice of you. <laughs> This isn't much, but take it. Oh, yeah? Well, thanks. Ah. Well, now, I guess I'll have to take good care of you. Okay. Call me if you have any problems, all right? Always appreciated. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> no. Do you sell whale here? No. You know any place around here that has it? I'm not really sure. But I'd love to get some. <laughs> no idea. Thanks. Got it. Well, the flash memory chip I gave to Fu actually worked. That's right. This is just the beginning. Yeah. Once we figure out how to use it, we're sitting on millions. 
We'll have to figure out how to spend it, huh? You were the best high-tech writer. And a good thief. Thank you. The next big thing is optical interconnection. Currently in the research phases, my man. Yeah? Let me handle selling that stuff. I don't know about that high-tech stuff. But when we go in there, we can't forget the Tata Kai. We should get some more men. Hmm. That sounds good. But what do we do with them all? Well, we could just use freelancers. Yeah, good idea. I'm tired of partners. Is that what Yuki's doing? Yeah. He's probably found some by now. In Kabukicho. Good. How about it? It's a pretty sweet deal. You just want me to hang out here? Yeah. But you come when I call. <laughs> Keeping me here is gonna cost you. <laughs> of course it will. I'm hiring you because I saw you ride when you were a pro. Here's your first installment. I'll be in touch. Sugiyama, what's our share now? If you subtract headquarters cut, it comes out to this much per person. Holy shit! I'll be able to buy Kabuki Cho in a day. If we continue generating money like this, that'll be true. If this is what your data says, then it's gotta be true. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you know any of the Tokyo Mafia? No. Then how are we gonna find them? By finding the leaders first. What do you mean? Ibuki's name is out in the open, but we don't know who else there is. You think he's not alone? Probably not. Is this something you're not telling me? Nah. Nah, my ass. Hey, you! Mm -hmm. Hey! Get hey. over here, you dumb shit! <laughs> whoa, whoa! Dude! <laughs> Are you Tokyo Mafia? What are you talking about? Then get lost! Tansy ass! Found anything? No, boss. Look over there. Right. You take over there. Right. I'll check it out. Yeah. Ishiyama's dogs are out looking for you. Keep your eyes open. Ishiyama gang, huh? Yeah. We'll be careful. Thanks, Sho. Tony. Yeah, boss? Find Yuki for me. Okay. Hey, isn't that Yuki? He quit the Yamaria with Yabuki. Let's go. Yeah, he might lead us right to him. Like gentlemen. Move, baby. Come on. Are you with the Tokyo Mafia now? You bastard. I'll teach you to fuck with me. Sorry, boss. Ah, fucker! Please! Please! Ow! Please! Ah. Kill us, boss! Sorry. Hmm? Hanada. Yeah? Get the car ready. Right away. 
Yuki! You okay? The Ishiyama gang's looking for information. Information, huh? Those bastards are trying to weasel into our market. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure Chief Moriwaki is behind them. You think so? Yeah. Boys, help him. Thanks. Sir? Are you sure you're polishing this vehicle? Of course I am. I know it's your favorite, so I take good care of it. Well, polish it right tomorrow. Right. I understand. And you better make it shine this time. Yes, sir. Genya, we should probably try to get our hands on some more weapons. Yeah. Forgive me, but I'm not getting involved in that. All you have to do is manage the whaling business for us. Don't worry about it. All right. Furukawa. Yeah? Dig up some dirt for me, huh? No problem. Let's go out and play with the Ishiyama. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Haven't I told you to keep this vehicle properly maintained? I always do. It was just inspected. Whew. That's funny. Ah! Hey, boss! What's wrong? Look, boss. <laughs> really? I wish I could have been there to see Ishiyama's face. <laughs> Yuki, you're even now, so let it go. Sure. Hi there, everyone. What's so funny? We just paid back a little bit. <laughs> I love you, Eileen. Oh, you're embarrassing me, Ginya, in front of everyone. <laughs> made me look like an idiot. But there isn't any proof that Yabuki did it. Who else could have done it? If you don't think we can trust him, 
Then why don't you stop doing business with them? Put a lid on it. That's another issue. What's the matter with you? I could hear you both from outside. I hear Ishiyama's favorite Mercedes was stripped. I'm afraid so. But we're dealing with this problem internally. Mm. If we're not careful, it could become your problem, too. Is that what Chief Moriwaki wanted? No. We were personally asked by the Ishiyama family. Then forget about it. If they asked as Tetokai, then don't you think they would have cleared this thing with me first? Sure, but boss, Yabuki was one of our own men, wasn't he? Yabuki's been excommunicated, so that's all over with. Isn't that right, Simon? Yes. Come in. Uh, excuse me, sir. There's a call from Mr. Kitayama. I'll transfer it in here for you. Hold it. That's fine. Excuse me. Simon. Yes. A second in command like him will ultimately keep us from growing. But it's true, Iwagami does help us in other ways. Try to ignore the smaller details and assist him, will you? Yes, sir. Also, give this back to Yabuki. He sent that to me. Tell him that I'm not so poor that he has to worry. He must have wanted you to have it. You may tell him that I'm very grateful. Yes, sir. Good work. Nice lock. Good job. Thank you. Good work. I appreciate it. I'll be in touch soon. Okay. Okay. okay? Give us a call anytime. Thank you. Thank you. You guys hungry? Yeah. I could eat. And today's total is just about 23 million. Huh? That's not too shabby, eh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's the place over there. I've been watching them all day. Who's this? Don't be rude. This is Mr. Lee, the assistant Chief Moriwaki sent. Sorry. Nice to meet you. Al Capone got rich off booze during the Prohibition. We're doing it with whale meat. But our prohibition's the ban. What the hell? We've got a virus. Hey, get Sugiyama on the phone. Right. a fax from your next client. Seems it's written in code. What's it mean? Well, what is it? Answer me!
You okay? Yeah. <clears throat> Please forgive me, sir. You idiot. <clears throat> We're not like the Yakuza. I'm sorry. Hey, boss. The warehouse is completely cleaned out. It definitely was the Tato Kai. Yeah. Let's get to it. Hold it. 120 gangs are all on the Tato Kai's side. Counting all of us, we've only got 70. We don't have a chance. What about Sugiyama? It was well done, Iwagami. So now, all we have to find are the trade routes. Could you possibly wait a little longer for that information? I believe your share is 5% of the revenues, am I correct? <laughs> I believe so. Which account? The Yamariyu account or your personal account? Uh, well, I mean... Uh... I see, your personal account. Does this job have anything to do with your organization? <laughs> uh, you're always teasing me. Well, Yamadaira can certainly be a little stubborn, shall we say. It'd be nice if the boss was sincere like you. But there is always a post as director open for you here. <sighs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> you ready to talk yet? Tell us the code. Even if you do crack our code, we'll just inform our partner. Who's our partner? Nice try. I'm sorry, Moriwaki. That's our little secret. We can change our schedule, locations, even our code. So what you gonna do, Moriwaki? <sighs> what am I going to do? We'll only lose this shipment of 500 kilos of whale meat. And Sugiyama. Not really so bad. <laughs> we certainly can't compete with that, can we? All right, then. Let's meet. I'll give you a call again soon. We can set up a meeting. Sure. The sooner the better. Oh, really? Then let's make it real soon. Just a moment. Go. I 
wasn't expecting this. Tokyo Mafia leader, Ginyu Yubuki, Moriwaki of Tetokai. Shall we get down to business? Sugiyama, the stolen disc, and the facts. That fucking bastard. You want me to hurt him bad? Please. Not yet. Go get Sugiyama and that fax. And Yabuki will leak that to Simon eventually. Let's leave this to Chief Moriwaki. <coughs> Boss! <coughs> Take the disc and the facts. What happened? Mr. Kung Fu did this to me. Mr. Moriwaki, this isn't what we agreed on, is it? No. It's your turn. Would you like to see us to the door? <clears throat> Don't touch me. After you. the check and the list in here. Thank you. It's all done. Yes. The list of those waiting to be naturalized and the check are all here. The deal is settled then. I guess everything's finished. Ah. Very good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Let's have dinner. Sure. Oh, miss. How would you like to work in Hong Kong? I'm sure you would do extremely well as an interpreter or as some other administrative assistant. Thanks. Okay. It sounds like fun. <laughs> hey, what was that all about? I wouldn't mind working in Hong Kong, you know? What do you think Ginyu would say? I want to try it. It's for you and me, Sho. But Ryoko, you're not looking all that healthy right now. It's just, I actually may not have that much time. I'm just kidding around. Hey, how about a drink? All right? Come on. <laughs> Dealing with them is one matter. The third area in Kabuki Cho is another. I got you. We dragon heads will have to take it slower. I control all of the blue dragons. Don't give me any trouble. Mm, I won't take all our problems all the way to Japan. And the same goes for them. I hope so. Oh. Changing the subject a little. I hear your sister is quite talented. Headquarters told me to give you their thanks. It's just for upfront deals, of course. There's no danger whatsoever. I appreciate it. Hey, 
boss. Oh, Yabuki. I've heard a lot about your business. And also about you and Moriwaki. Sorry to trouble you. Don't be careless with your life. I can't protect you out here anymore. I know that. What's really bothering me is that there might come a time one day when I'll be forced to make you one of the targets of the Tejokai. What's really bothering me is that there might come a time one day when I'll be forced to make you one of the targets of the Tejokai. I heard. Ryoko told me about her illness. Did she? Then why don't you take her? You know how she feels. <laughs> I could never do that. Here. The boss said to give it back. What do you mean? I understand how you feel. But the boss shouldn't be taking it the way things are right now. I left the organization. But I still try to honor him. You should take this and forget about trying to honor him. How can you stand there and tell me that you don't know where your bookie is? We've looked under every rock and stone in the whole city. The chief seems to be in a bad mood lately. He's looking after you now, but how long will he continue to do that? I won't give up till I find him. Can you help me? Iwagami. We're with the Taito Kai, remember? I know that. We'll get the Yamariu gang to help us, following the rules of the Yakuza. Move it! your asses, people! Out of the way! Get out of my Move fucking way, you people. bastards! Move it! Out of the way! Out of the way! Here. Get out of my face! Move it! you fox hurry up get your ass out of that chair come on get out of here you drunk fox have a seat boss gentlemen you can't do this uh, no problem you're disturbing all my customers please stop it sure where's yabuki i don't know well this is his club isn't it yeah but he's not here You tell him this. His plans ain't gonna work. Come on. Leave our calling card. Right, right. right. Out of the way, bitch. No. 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 What's wrong? I've met that broad somewhere before. You really do get around, don't you? You know, don't you? Don't worry, I didn't hear it from you. I'm telling you the truth, sir. I don't know. 
Don't try to tell us you don't know where your own mob brother is, Simon. Can I use the phone? Yeah. Naginya. It's me. I'm with Iwagami. He says he wants to know where you are. Yeah. Hey, Yabuki. It's been a long time, my friend. You getting my contributions to your personal account? Huh? Yeah, sure thing. You busy? Do you have any time to talk? What would you and I talk about? Simon doesn't even know where I am right now. And I'm going to get a new cell phone today. You'll never find me. Yabuki! <sighs> now what are we gonna do? No way we can fight the Tedokai on the streets. Us a good hit, man. Is a boss asking? No. No. No, they will cost you. How's this? Fifty million? Yeah. Okay.
you help me out? Could you wait over there? An old fairy's gonna pull up in a limo. It'll be a little while. <laughs> Yuki. Hi there. All set. Hey, Moriwaki. Fucker! Jasmine tea. It'll help relax you. Thanks. We'll help you fix up the club. It's fine. Being with you is enough. Hey, Yuki. <laughs> What's going on? I've taken care of everything. It's over. It's finally over. You didn't. I got rid of Moriwaki for you. You fucking <laughs> fool! When did I authorize that? You know there was no other way. You said that we couldn't go out and fight them in the street, didn't you? That was very stupid. But we got rid of the Tetokai boss. This means we've beaten them. Do you want your head chopped off? Aizawa, it's me. Tell everyone you see to head underground. Yuki took out Moriwaki. But boss... Go to the Philippines for a while. What for? What do I have to run and hide for now? I did this for the Tokyo Mafia! Do you want to fucking die? Now there's no choice! We gotta go. Get going! So it was Yabuki's group who did it. I don't think that Ginya is that stupid. Very true. 
I know Yabuki can be a loose cannon, but he's not this crazy. You saying that the Yamaryo isn't plotting something? What do you mean by that? I have heard rumors around that you control the Tokyo Mafia. Yabuki was cut off over three years ago. It's still something that we should know about. We know you must be up to something. What are you talking about, Nokuchi? Are you accusing me of something? That's enough. Just calm down. He should pay for what he's done. Exactly. Bring Yabuki's head to us on a plate. Right, Ishiyama? Yeah. But it's complicated. What do you mean, Ishiyama? Well, I didn't really mean anything. I don't know if he did it or not, but we should, of course, take out the one who did. Well, we'll see how you decide to handle this one. We can't trust those guys. You take some men and find your buki. Right. I won't let you down. What the hell is this Tokyo Mafia? They're a mysterious bunch, huh? We don't even know where their headquarters is located. Then where do we start? We got ways and won't give up till we find the fucker. They're not Yakuza and they're not street punks. How can your buki? What is he up to? What are you thinking? Just wondering if Yuki got away. Don't worry. I'm sure he did. Well, what did Chief Moritaka say? Forget it. He checked into a hospital this morning. Shit, the old man ran away. Hey, what about Amino Tokai? That leaves Chief Akasaka of Hijirikai. Good idea. I'm pretty sure he'll listen to us. Well, I guess we go give him a try. Yubuki. You have worked as an assistant to the second in command in the Yamariu. But you don't appear to understand or respect our rules. Do you think it's wrong for me? To make up for it? You want to reconcile? Straight people can't appease the Yakuza. It's our law. You think I'm straight? Are you Yakuza? I don't know the details, but I know you were excommunicated. If I consider you one of the Yakuza, then I'll oppose the Yamariu, and that goes for the Tedokai as well. And that's what the rules of the Yakuza are, I'm afraid. If it's a matter of money, I'll pay any amount necessary. This isn't about money. The only way you can live as a straight man is to apologize to them and break up your group or just run away. I told you I'm not a straight man. Then you're a Yakuza, yes? Are you a Yakuza? I'm not Yakuza either. You're not a straight man, and you're not Yakuza. Tokyo Mafia, it's not an organization. It doesn't have any system. We don't even need a physical headquarters. We all take shares of the profits. We split it up evenly. So you're a secret society, then? Pretty much. That's why a large group like the Tetokai is worried. 
Somehow we've managed to survive against them. But now that we've killed Chief Moriwaki, they'll gather their forces against us. When they do, it's all over. Well, I'm afraid there's no way to reconcile if you're not Yakuza. So that's all there is, huh? There is one way, besides a deal. <sighs> Please tell me. You've got to destroy the Tato Kai entirely. Destroy them? The only way is if you help us Yabuki, do it. Yabuki, do not misunderstand me. If we assist you, we make enemies with the Yakuza all across Japan. Sorry. We have no reason to become the Tato Kai's enemy, and we owe you nothing. That's my decision. Chief! If you plead for your life as a straight man, then I'll help you. I'm not pleading for my life. Then a war in the streets is all that is left. I tried to get them to settle. Even Chief Akasaka. He wouldn't come through with any help. Nah. The Tato Kai will come after you, Ginya. You better get out of Japan, till it's safe again. I thought about that. That's just not my style. So what are you gonna do? The real reason I called you here today was to clear my conscience. I think I'm tired of hiding in the shadows. The Tokyo Mafia is coming out. You're kidding. No, I'm not. The war is about to begin. What are you, insane? Just a little bit. But seriously. Give your boss a message. Tell him I'm disgracing my father to be a good son. Then this... I guess this is the end of the road for us.